friends. Morning. So today we are going to find the stiffness matrix for the same problem. So in this class, how the stiffness matrix should be formed? That is how I am going to explain here. So step number five. So finding the stiffness matrix. So how to find stiffness matrix? We have to use a formula. What is the formula? Stiffness of the element A is equal to for one time the power element. What is the formula? A E by A E by L into one minus one minus one. So this is the formula. We are going to find it for the elements one and two. So that is what the next step. Finding the stiffness matrix. So what is the Element number one for element number one. So this means a number in the round represents element, right? For element number one. For element number one, what is the area? This area, average area of element one. What is the average area of element one? Three to eight point five. Three to eight one point five. Into n quarters is given as point two five. Okay, point two five into two into ten power five divided by length of diagonal number one is three hundred. Two point two five. So what is the answer? So if we substitute in the calculator, you will get. If you are going to say it loudly, two point one eight, two point one eight, seven into seven into into two six. Okay. So here you have to write it as a one one, a one two, a two one, a two. So similarly, find it for element number two. For element number two, that is, what is the average area of element number two? Two three four. Yes. Two three four eight two one seven five four eight seven. Two three four three four eight seven five into x minus is two into ten power five is given in that question. And the element number two length is three hundred m. So what is the final value of calculation? One point five six two into ten to the power six. Very good. So one point five six two into ten to the power six. Is it right? So here how do you write here? A two one. Is it A two one or A two two? A two two two. A two two. Right. So here you have to begin with A two two. A two three. A Three two and here is A three. So now we are going to assemble the equations. So before going to assemble the stiffness matrix, we must know that this value is 2.187 and here the value is 1.562. So what we have to do is keeping that 1 into 10 power 6 as common for both the matrix outside, this 2.187 can be multiplied inside. Similarly here, that 1.562 can be multiplied inside the matrix. Now I am going to assemble. So what is the outside term? So to common the outside, one, one point, into ten, ten power six is taken outside as common for both the matrix. Now I am going to assemble the stiffness matrix of that problem. Please listen. So here the stiffness matrix. There are terms. I will write here a one 
1 here it is a 2 1 here it is a 3 1 similarly here a 1 2 here a 2 2 here a 1 2 here a 1 3 This is what you have to write here. As I told earlier, now you can see the matrix. What is the A11 value? 2.187. So multiply with the term and tell me 2.187. What is A12? Minus 2.187. Minus 2.187. What is A13? Zero. Zero. Because there is no A13 here as well as there is no A13 here. So put zero here. Clear? Now a two one. What is a two one? Minus two point one eight seven. What is a two two? Two point one eight seven according to element number one. According to element number two, a two two is plus one point five six two. So plus. 1.562 comes from element number 2. So what is A23? Minus 2.1562. Minus 1.562. Minus 1.562. What is A31? Zero. zero. Is there any zero. three one term? No. Zero. So put zero. What is A32? Again, not minus a three to s minus one into one point five six two is minus one point five six two a three three one point five six two. So this is how you have to write the k matrix. Now after writing the k matrix, you can write the final value as. One into ten power six. Take it formally outside. That two point one eight seven. Here it is minus two point one eight seven. Here it is zero. Here it is two minus two point one eight seven. What is the value? Three point seven five two. Three point seven five two. Seven five two. Three point seven five two. Again minus one point five six two. Here it is zero. Here it is. Minus one point five six two. Here is one point five six two. So this is how we have to find the stiffness matrix. So far we have followed the stiffness matrix. Thank you.